How's it going movie fans? The 27th of January 2024 is the 84th birthday of actor and producer James Cromwell, an Academy Award nominated actor whose on-screen acting career began with a role on television series The Rockford Files in 1974, with his feature film debut coming two years later with Murder by Death in 1976. Cromwell has consistently proven to have a strong screen presence, perhaps assisted by a 6 foot 7 frame. Cromwell currently has four projects in production, here are the file's top 10 James Cromwell movies. At number 10 is Babe. Cromwell received an Academy Award nomination for Best Supporting Actor for his performance as Arthur Hoggart, a farmer who wins Piglet Babe in a contest, and after taking him back to the farm, he is taken in by a border collie and Babe develops a talent for herding sheep, but struggles to get the other animals to take him seriously. The runtime is 91 minutes, and Babe has a foul rating of 7.5 out of 10. At number 9, is still mine. In this romantic drama based on a true story, Cromwell plays Craig Morrison, an octogenarian farmer in a Canadian village who decides to build a more suitable home on his property which better fits the needs of him and his wife, with his wife showing early signs of dementia. But Craig runs into bureaucratic obstacles. The runtime's 102 minutes, and still mine has a foal rating of 7.6. At number 8, is Star Trek First Contact. In the 8th film in the Star Trek franchise and the second instalment of the Next Generation film series, Cromwell plays Zephram Cochrane, the pilot and creator of Earth's first warp capable vessel whose maiden voyage comes under threat when alien group the Borg travel through time to prevent Earth's introduction to aliens. The runtime is 11 minutes and Star Trek First Contact has a foal rating of 7.7. .7. At number 7, is the Queen. This biographical drama depicts the events surrounding the death of Diana, Princess of Wales in 1997, and how it sent shockwaves through the royal family, including Queen Elizabeth II, as the response to the death is scrutinised by the public. Cromwell plays Prince Philip, Duke of Edinburgh, the husband of Queen Elizabeth II. The runtime time 3 minutes, and the Queen has a foal rating of 7.8. At number 6, is Failsafe, a made-for-TV remake of the 1964 film of the same name, set in the 1960s at the height of Cold War tensions between the US and Russia, where a technical failure occurs which threatens to start a nuclear war if the two countries can't come together to fix it. Cromwell plays engineer Gordon Knapp. The runtime is 86 minutes, and Failsafe has a foul rating of 8.1. At number 5, is The Artist, a modern day black and white silent film. This romantic comedy drama follows George Valentin, a movie star in 1927 who through association helps a young dancer in her rise to stardom, but is soon finding the invention of talkies to be putting his own career in jeopardy. Cromwell plays Clifton, Valentin's chauffeur. The runtime is 100 minutes, and The Artist has a foal rating of 8.1. At number 4, is Big Hero 6. Based on the Marvel comic book of the same name, after a tragic event shakes up the life of 14 year old robotics prodigy Hero Hamada, he, along with a group of friends, including an inflatable robot called Baymax, try to unravel a mystery. Cromwell voices Robert Callahan, the head of a robotics program at the San Francisco Institute of Technology. The runtime is 102 minutes, and Big Hero 6 has the foal rating of 8.3. At number 3 is The Green Mile. Based on the 1996 novel of the same name, set in the 1930s, this fantasy drama shows how the lives of the prison guards working on death row are changed forever after one of the inmates convicted of a heinous crime begins demonstrating extraordinary gifts. Cromwell plays prison warden Hal Moores. The runtime is 189 minutes, and The Green Mile has a foul rating of 8.3. At number 2 is The People vs Larry Flint. In this biographical drama depicting the true story of Larry Flint, the publisher of Hustler magazine, who becomes a defender of freedom of speech when he is taken to court following a backlash from the religious community and anti-pornography activists. Cromwell plays Charles Keating, the founder of the organisation Citizens for Decent Literature. The runtime is 130 minutes, and The People vs Larry Flint has a foul rating of 8.4. At number 1, is LA Confidential. Based on the 1990 novel of the same name, set in Los Angeles in the 1950s, this neo-noir crime drama sees three police officers with differing ambitions, experience and temperaments get involved in a multiple homicide case which becomes known as the Night Owl Case. Cromwell plays precinct captain Dudley Smith. The runtime time's 138 minutes and LA Confidential has a foul rating of 9.1. Thanks for watching, next week I'll be counting down the foul's top 10 Warwick Davis movies and if you enjoyed this list please don't forget to leave a like, comment and subscribe.